Okay, today I'm going to stick the brakes all back together on the gearbox for the Chieftain, on Seb's Chieftain. The discs have all been skimmed, got new brake pads to go in, uh, and then we're going to fit the gearbox, and then hopefully we might even fit the engine. We'll see how we get on. And uh, yeah, it'll be good to get it running and driving. We've got the stuff turning up from the sandblasters, um, the side plates, the bin boxes, so we're going to bolt all that on. And then we can actually do the final painting for the uh, for the vehicle. So this should be exciting. Oh, yes, sexy. Very fashionable here. That's what happens when the sun comes out, right? Yeah, dress no dress for the weather. <laughs> Get your dump truck in there. <laughs> hell. Jack, I think I can see your ankle, mate. They're off. <laughs> the zipper's under a fair bit of strain. We're all ponytail. While Jack finished off the few bits that needed painted under the gearbox, I finished off the leaks and tested up the Abbott pack from yesterday. It's like a meerkat. You have to hold this in place, and with the other hand, you have to move this heavy piece of junk about. Ah. Pretty good. Oh, I'm a f 
okay it is. Easy peasy, boys. Oh. Right, we're gonna put the gearbox in. I would look at you, but the sun's in my eyes, but I'm not gonna complain. Jack's just putting the shims in now, setting that all up. Are you right already? Yeah. That means yes. Let's start the phoning up. I'm sling it in. two um, pipes that go to the firewall for the brakes either side. We've also got to put the quill shafts in, which if you look directly down there, basically we're gonna wind a rod in, which we'll show you, and it will push the quill shaft and lock it into the gearbox. And you do that both sides. And then that basically marries the gearbox up with the final drives, giving power to the tracks. I've had to put glasses on to explain complicated things so people understand it because I look clever with glasses on. Uh, he doesn't know, he's not clever without glasses on, to be honest. Here's my best Jeremy Corbyn look, what do I call that? You socialist git. Well, I nearly fell off then. Oh, I didn't say you wanted you dead, I said I wanted you dead. <laughs> okay, so these are the tools that you use for locking the quills in. Okay, and these go in. This is the final drop, this is a sprocket for those that don't know. So these go in here. Now, annoyingly, that's in the way. So I'm gonna get the gas and just gas through that bit there, and maybe that one, and it'll go in. And Ted disagrees now, with that. We're gonna have to just push this forward with the uh, Foden until we've got a line of fire, which is really annoying because this side will, will, will go in, but then the other side I can guarantee so should we go and check the other side now to prove that that We don't one... need to prove. I, I know almost guarantee you that when we move that, it'll block that side. Well, yeah, but why don't you start with the other side? That's probably not blocked up, isn't it? Blocked up, isn't it, Sam? <sighs> you, I'll let you figure that out. Yep. Right, I'll get the uh, phone <laughs> right, are we in the sun there? Is that bad? It's good enough. Okay, this is the quill shaft removal and and removal. What's the word for removal? Under word for removal. So you want to sound dead professional? What's the other word for removal? Extract. No, Extract. when you put it back in. Replace. Re no. It puts it back in or Reinsert. Yeah, Re that'll do. So yeah, we'll go for that. So um, yeah, it's a bit of a, a two-trick pony. So now I'm going to just simply slide that in. There we go. Straight in. Kill. So now that 
slipped in place. We need to take the tool back off. A little bit of spinning, a bit of spinning action. Throw that in the skip. Then we need to put the brass insert in. Put a bit of WD on the old threads. And then this uh, locking piece, screw that on. Now somewhere, I have a proper chieftain, well, I think you do actually, uh, Allen key that fits in there. And then I'll just nip that up and then flathead screw goes in there and holds it in place. And then we'll do the other side, so. Now with the official chieftain screwdriver. That was very lucky. <laughs> I thought that was gone forever. <laughs> God, what an absolute cowboy. <laughs> this would be so much easier if I wasn't drunk. I know, yeah, such an amateur. <sighs> right, that's that side done. Now on to the next. I can't believe it. This side's actually lined up. No. It cannot be. It simply cannot be. Good God. I know. And right. you did spend the first half of this video explaining that that wouldn't be the case. Yeah. So now you look like an absolute liar. Oh, yeah, because you look like a f***ing bloke at the Well, I did have glasses on. Well, there is that. So actually, you're the only person to put glasses on and become less Perfect. intelligent. Yeah, there you go. That's just proof that people with glasses are stupid. That's not where I was going with that. Oh, isn't it? Uh, it's proof that people with big ears that talk a lot of walk around the world. There you go. What do you think? Pay peanuts, get elephants. <laughs> <laughs> Whose socks are this? Jack's. Mine! What's it coming down here? I'm not going to have gangrene of the finger now. I don't have gangrene, I've got gout. Gout of the finger? Too much red wine, that's what that is. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Put it WD-50. Jack, have you got any linseed oil that I can rub into these? Oh, I left it alone. I can rub into these uh, road wheels. Just use a bit of spit. That's disgusting. Bring quite some grain pop. Make the green pop. <laughs> this is just a video at the back of my head. It is, and Jack trying to throw shit at us. At uh, us or you? Me. Uh, I, I wouldn't get, I'd generalise it was both of you. Don't generalise it, that's sexy. Okay. Well, that's the quills back in. So, the gearbox is all connected. Minus the electrics. Ah, oh, direct hit. The steering brakes. The engine. So that's how easy it is to put a gearbox in a Centurion. Do you want to swing? Yeah, go on in. I don't like them. Oh, they taste sour. <laughs> <laughs> They're just oh, not Here's a tip, don't eat them. I'm hungry. I'm only eating them because they're yours. I know you are. Red one. Yeah. Yeah, the, ra the red ones are the rank. No, no, they're not. Oh, can't do that because it's like watching the slow coat. Yeah, yeah, you're right, yeah. So this is the emergency gear. This is yeah, the gear yeah. that you use. Talk to Seb, because he's not recording. An emergency. Basically, if you lose all your electrics, which is very unlikely that you can, um, you, you have basically the chance of first gear, or it may be second, I can't remember, and uh, reverse and neutral. 
which is apparently enough to get you out of an emergency. Yeah, I'll tell you what, it's a bit too, bit too hot. I'm going to have to have the rest of the week off. Nah. I probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference. <laughs> Glad you're switched on. Yeah, at least yeah. someone is. Not like this moron that's trying to put a simple P-clip on. You're going the right way for a f***ing hiding. Oh my god. Oh, I've got an earpiece in because I drive the X7 to Northampton. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> Please stop being huge. Oh, um, it's a bit too hot. I can't work today. Oh, I'll tell you, my hands are cold. I can't work today. We have spent seven minutes watching you do this one clip, though. This is literally the whole YouTube. Can you it's just you putting a P clip on. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, keep it rolling. <laughs> Could you get me the proper little set with some um, sockets in it, please? The little set. The little set. The really handy set that you love. I might actually be able to do something then. What, what I'm doing is I'm trying to save time by struggling. But what that's actually doing is wasting time. I can't wait to see what the, the people of the internet think. Ten minutes into this. <laughs> no, you might better do that and then log out through boredom. Memory lane is like a winding road. <laughs> By God! By gum! He's only gone and bloody done it! Nice work there, Jack. Thanks, mate. It's only it took, taking me a second. It took longer to put them wires on than put the whole gearbox in the tank. Probably. And the quills. No, it didn't. It took you long to do the quills. Still haven't done it. It's embarrassing. We just we we were premature. Look, he's getting a bit of a vein on. And his <laughs> arm. How can you see me knob from there? <laughs> I've got it on eight times. <laughs> <laughs> I've walked into that one. No one else will. We. Uh, Lucy lies into it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's not include that in the video, please. It'd be grand. Yeah, the only time I was filming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, about right, yeah. Oh, I didn't miss that one. Why are you slagging me off in your video? I wonder how much of that I can use on TikTok. Not a lot. <laughs> Probably none of it. <laughs> Again, Jack tightens up one bolt in the entire video. <laughs> Episode 25. Jack moves up to the second bolt. <laughs> I wonder how long it's going to take for a zip tie. After 15 minutes, we realised he was turning it the wrong way. You're going to have to work that zip tie. I'm just going to put it the wrong way around. Draw your diagram. <laughs> Don't turn it the wrong way. You got another one? I have got another one. Yeah, Make ready. sure you don't get your uh, fingers caught. You made zip tie dispenser. Yeah, these are special uh, um, English <laughs> And that can't go on YouTube. Why not? I wonder why. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean, no? Oh, I forgot to take the piss out of Matt Allcroft. Or do you want another cable guy? Yeah, let me just cut one badly. Do one down there or something, just set this out of him. <sighs> Matt Allcroft would be here, of course, but he's eating yeah. Greg somewhere at the side so, of the yeah, room. Matt Allcroft would be here, but his Amarok's broken down. Again. So he can't make it, unfortunately. But, but he has bought a Ford Ranger that don't break down. He has, he has yeah. He bought the one, the 2.5 that, that actually that breaks down, down all the time. Yeah, yeah, because he's a genius. But in, um, in memory of Matt being here, I'm going to cut this cable tie off nice and neat. No, no, you did a really good accent. That's... Let's put that on this time. Oh, I can't remember the accent. Come on. It's not hard to sound uneducated. <sighs> uneducated? Syndicated. No, that's not the right accent. You <laughs> ask the bloke off towing team. That's easy. Didn't I'll, uh, I'll, I'll see me. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's he's better. He's there we character. go. We're into bloody accent now. Well, that's gone a bit the rather than that has. Right, so when you want to do this, you cut the cable tie off nice and flush so that the next bloke slashes his thumb on it. Yeah. <laughs> 
Nice like that, all right. <laughs> Mechanic rule number 3038 from a tractor driver. It blows up chimneys. It blows up chimneys. Right, see yeah. you later. Right, shall I do a sign it out video? Do you want to do a sign yeah, out yeah, video? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll yeah, stand yeah. over there, I think. But yeah, good idea. I need to get over there without standing on me. Clean things. You could just levitate over there, that'd be great. <laughs> right, so. Thank you all for watching this fit this gearbox in instead of Chieftain. Hopefully tomorrow when you put in the engine in. I didn't want to do it today, but Jack's got to go to the gym because he's fat. Um, thank you all for watching. Now we'll see you think in the belly. next video. You're a bit of a gym. So if you follow his Instagram, you'll see topless <laughs> yeah, yeah. follow photos of him. Yeah, yeah can't show you yet. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm working on it, all right? Work in progress. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.